I think, I think there's, they, on some level, they absolutely identify with each other. Um, they oddly have many things in common, um, one being the most important person for both of them, which is my father um, and her greatest love. And so th there's just so much, there's so much energy between them, good, bad, horrible, ugly. I, I mean, it, but th I think that plays out in the scenes and it's so much fun to get to play that opposite each other because, well, Madeline's wonderful and brilliant, but there's just a lot to play and that's the of you because you've created these complex characters and, uh, and I think that, um, I think that's, uh, there's this really cool, there's this really cool yeah. scene coming up with Tweeny too, I believe it's in this episode, right? The, when you bring the um, engagement pre present over oh. and ask her to hold on yes. to it. Um, and there's, there's the some, last oh, never mind. Was that sick, was it? It was. Oh, God. Well, I love that scene, um, and I love it. I love it how so many people corrected you. I know, I know. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, um, I, I love that scene because, you know, you go in there and you're 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 just a little bit. Uh, you're more open. You're more injured than we see you in front of Emily. Really, mm -hmm. <clears throat> ever. Your son is. This is your worst nightmare. Mm -hmm. Um, and, uh, and you like that it's her worst nightmare, but it's also becoming one of yours because you like, Dan you love Daniel yeah. in a certain way. Well, you don't, not a Absolutely. Jack way, but in a Daniel way. <laughs> and, we also, uh, we also um, start to see a bit of, oh, sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, you, you, you go, know, go, go. So I talk too much. Please go. No, I, don't, I like right. it when you talk. So, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I think what I was trying to say is that what was fun about this sincere scene that felt, I mean, it, it had a back and forth, and you did all this wonderful, wicked stuff, and, and you came with a little bit more of your heart on your sleeve, but also a bit of a threat. And then you tag it with this, well, one be, or whatever you learned in juvie might just come in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Really? It's so, me it's so rotten. So I just, I love that. And she just, you just give a look like, oh, I hate her. <laughs> <laughs> what Emily does, is, Emily does is really clever whenever she's with Daniel. Because, okay, look, there's this Oedipal thing happening that we can't really acknowledge because it's ABC. But <laughs> <laughs> You also can't ignore. I can't, ignore, can't ignore, right. That's part of it. But, but Emily will do things. She's so clever where she'll like give Daniel the extra kiss like in front of me to kind of twist the knife, <laughs> you know? And I just want to kick her ass around. <laughs> That's the thing. But it's, it's just so funny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, we have a good time. <laughs> so Emily, on your side, these two will never get along, will they? What's that? Th this is the mother-in-law from hell it for you, isn't it? Oh, from hell. Oh, <laughs> Um, but but I think I think uh, my character takes a lot of pleasure in in um, making Victoria's life miserable. So um, so yeah, there's, I definitely try to find those moments where you know I, I hold his hand just a little longer, or you know. And I think that I think we, we have this very bizarre competition for Daniel, but we're coming from very different places with it. So poor. Joshua Bowman over there having to be stuck in the middle, like a tug of war, you know. Um, but it's, but it, it, you know, it's a, it's a lot of fun to play. I love some, those scenes are some of my favorite. They're just because there's so much going on, and yet we're all smiling. And Not all me. <laughs> Good. So, Josh, who do you think Daniel would choose in that battle? Mm. Such a mommy's boy. Well, he is a mommy's. He is a mommy's boy, to be fair. But, but I think things are going to change. So I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to things changing a bit. This show's always changing, like the whole time, and uh, I think that I'm definitely looking forward to, to some sort of darker turns, you know? So we'll see. Can't spill too much, mm -hmm. can we? Thank, anyway, I just yes, want to say thanks to everyone to come to, today and like, <laughs> take the Sunday off. <laughs> Thank you. No, but, no, but seriously, mm -hmm. we, we, we appreciate you being here, and it's nice. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So Emily, how do you keep other Emily likable when she's committing you know, horrible <coughs> crimes in the name of revenge. How is that a challenge for you as an actor? Well, that was initially when I read the pilot, that was my biggest fear was that um, she, she wouldn't be likable or, or you know, that people wouldn't continue to root for her. But you know, you, we've seen it done before in shows like Dexter, which is one of my favorite shows, and I'm a big, yes, <laughs> so good. Michael C. all does it brilliantly, and I think um, I think at the core of it, it's it's first of all, you know, seeing what she's been through. It's so important to go back in time and see <clears throat> what this family put this little girl through, um, 
and, and to sort of to see that part of it. But I think also it's, um, you know, in, in maintaining a sort of moral code within the character, um, which she has. And, I, and even though she's doing these horrendous things, there, there, is, um, there is a sense of integrity about her that I, I, I certainly try to always bring to her. And, um, and you know, I, and I think also, you know, Madeline said it best in the beginning and was sort of criticized for it, but, you know, she was proved to be right that, you know, people want to see the takedown of the rich right now. And um, it's, it's a really, it's, you know, it's, it's a really kind of appealing part of the story. And, um, and we get to do that. I get to, my, my character gets to do that. So it's, it's really, I mean, I think that people relate to that on some level as well. But so. you're rich too, so how do you I'm right. <laughs> I know, We're all right. not as rich. <laughs> not as rich. Yeah, not, not as. as. Not as. But everything is. But it's, you know, all right, it's, it's both of you and Pat itself with your bank statement. Right. <laughs> <laughs>